Hello my creepy lovelies and welcome back to another cliffhanger text story. This one is called Past Life. Let's begin, shall we? Unknown says, is this Lola? Lola says, yes. Who is this? That's not important. Just a bit of advice, guys. If somebody, you know, that you have no idea who they are, contacts you through phone, asks for your name and stuff, don't immediately say yes. You know, ask who it is. <laughs> but what I have to tell you is... There's something you need to know about Hunter. Who are you? I knew your boyfriend years ago. He's not who he claims to be. Go to heck. Go to hell, actually. Like I told you guys, it's okay to say hell if you're telling someone to go to hell. You... I feel like I'm not a good role model for just that sentence. <laughs> you're probably just some jealous creep from school. Maybe this will make you believe me. Image received. Why can't we see it? What the heck? What is this? But, you know, saying, what the H-E, double hockey sticks, that's more of a cur- I'm, I'm just gonna stop talking. <laughs> a high school yearbook photo. Don't you recognize Hunter? Yes, but there's a different name by the picture. I know. A little strange, don't you think? It is strange. I need more proof than that. You could have just photoshopped this. How about this? Image receipt. Let us see the pictures, dang, nabbit. The heck? Is this a mugshot? Yes. Recognize the face in it? Where did you get this? It's public record. I guess Hunter never showed it to you. Must have slipped his mind. Who the heck are you? Someone your boyfriend thought he'd never see again. Oh, probably like a cellmate or something. Somebody he probably flipped on. Tell me or I'm blocking you. I wouldn't do that. Why not? I'm the only one who can save you. I know you're home alone tonight. Waiting for Hunter to pick you up for your date. No, I'm not. Don't waste my time with lies. I'm trying to help. You don't want to know what he's planning to do to you. How do you know all of this? I've been following Hunter for a long time. I have unfinished business with him. What do you mean? It would take too long to explain. I didn't want to involve you in this, but I can't let him hurt you. He's hurt enough people already. This is insane. Lola, you have to listen to me. We don't have much time. New message from Hunter. Hey, babe, I'll be there in a minute. Don't come over. Why not? Something wrong? You moved here from another state two years ago, right? Yeah, why? Did you ever get arrested there? Or have a different name? No. Then how do you explain this? Where did you get this? Someone sent it to me. Who? Doesn't matter. That is you in the mugshot, right? What were you arrested for? Hunter? Answer me! It's not what you think. I, I can explain. Explain, then. I can't over the phone. It has to be in person. Say why, tell me why. I'll say why instead of tell me now. <laughs> it's complicated. But I promise I'll tell you everything. I'm at your door now. Can you let me in? Lola? Hello? Please open the door. New message from unknown, or to unknown. Okay, I believe you. I sent Hunter the mugshot, and he won't explain it to me. You shouldn't have done that. Now he knows you're onto him. Where is he now? At my front door. Is it locked? Yes. Good. Don't let him in. Okay. Should I call the police? There's no time. You don't know Hunter. He's capable of anything. Okay, to be fair, she doesn't know you either, and she knows Hunter a lot better than she knows you, so why should she trust you? <laughs> He's banging on the door and shouting. Do you have a back door? Yes. Get out of the house now. Okay. He just kicked open the front door. Get out of there quick. Okay, I'm in the backyard. Go through the woods behind your house to the park. See, no, how does this person know all of this about her? I'll meet you there and drive you to the police station. Okay. New message from Hunter. Lola, where are you? I need to talk to you. Whoever sent you that picture, you can't trust them. Screw you. I wouldn't trust Hunter or the person. You lied to me about your past and broke into my house. You're the one I can't trust. I'm sorry about the door, but I need to see you right away. If the person who sent that pic is who I think, you could be in real danger. I don't believe you. I'm in the park. Where are you? Standing by the pond. Okay, I see you. I'm coming. Good. 
Oh, one more thing, Lola. See, what I tell you? Oh my gosh, don't trust either one of them. Oh my gosh. What? I lied. What do you... One hour later. Wake up, Lola. Where am I? Where does it look like? An old house? There's barely any light. How did I get here? Why do I feel dizzy? I'm sorry. I had to chloroform you in the park. I don't think you would have come here willingly. Why is my ankle chained to a pipe? Sorry about that too. You seem like a nice girl. You can thank Hunter for what comes next. What do you mean? Where are you going to do? Wait, oh, what are you going to do to me? <laughs> You'll see. And so will Hunter. I'm going to show him what happens when you try to walk away from the past. Ooh. Please let me go. Hunter is the one you should be begging right now. What? What do you mean? I sent him the location of this abandoned house. He has ten minutes to come here and face me. Or I'm coming inside. And emptying my gun into his girlfriend. Why are you doing this? To remind Hunter of what he really is. A coward. I doubt he'll risk his life to save yours. Why do you say that? You don't know Hunter. Eh, why do you say that? He betrayed me two years ago. To save himself. Once a coward, always a coward. What do you mean betrayed you? What did he do? Why don't you ask him about me? His old friend Sean. New message to Hunter. Hunter? Are you there? Lola! Are you okay? You mean aside from being chained to a pipe? <laughs> With an armed psychopath outside? Well, to be fair, you kind of brought that on yourself. You weren't asking the right questions and you trusted a complete stranger. <laughs> I have your location. I'm coming to save you. Are you sure? What do you mean? Sean said you wouldn't come. He's a liar! He says you betrayed him. Did you? I had no choice. What do you mean? It was the only way. I wanted a new life. What are you talking about? Before I moved to your town? Before I met you? I was a different person. I was in a gang. A gang? You're only 18! They recruit young. I joined when I was 15. I did some bad things. But after a year I wanted out. They don't let you leave so easily though. What does this have to do with Sean? He was in my gang too. We did a major robbery together. And got arrested. I really wanted out of the gang by then. So I testified against him. And a few other members. Ooh, that is dangerous. You ratted on him? It was the only way out of that life. In exchange for my testimony, they put me and my family in the witness re relocation program. That's how I ended up in your town. I can't believe this. Sean was 19 and got tried as an adult. He got five to 10 years, but he must have escaped somehow. I don't know how he found me. Why didn't you tell me about any of this? I'm sorry, but there's no time to argue. I'm almost at the house. I'm going to face Sean and end this. He has a gun! So do I. Wait, this pipe I'm chained to is really rusty. I, I think I can break it. There's no time. Just hang on, I'm coming. I hear gunshots! What's happening? Five minutes later. I'm sorry. What do you mean? Are you okay? Sean got the drop on me. Oh no. We shot at each other. But I got hit. I escaped into the woods. I'm out of bullets. Oh, great. Where did you get shot? The stomach. Oh, I'm bleeding bad. Where's Sean? Stop texting and just call the freaking police. I don't know. I tried to draw him away from the house, but I don't hear him anymore. I'm too weak to move. You're going to be okay. I've been hitting this pipe with a brick. It's almost broken. Really? Hurry before Sean comes back. I broke the pipe off the wall. I'm free. Thank God. Get out of there! Crap! I hear footsteps in the next room. It must be him! Hide! There's nowhere to hide! I'm trapped! Do something! He's at the d Lola? Babe, are you there? Babe! Hello? I'm okay! What happened? Where's Sean? Knocked out. Just as he came in, I remembered the pipe. I clocked him on the head with it. Holy crap! I took his gun and locked him in the closet, <laughs> calling the police down. Dang, way to go, Lola. Way to go, babe. But I'm sorry. I should have protected you. Don't think about that now. Focus on staying alive. I'm coming to find you. I shouldn't have lied about my past either. This is all my fault. I hate myself so much. Do you think you can forgive me? 
I don't know. I forgive you. I don't think you like immediately forgive them. So I'll say I don't know. We'll talk about it later. I understand. Hunter Smith was airlifted to a nearby hospital and survived his gunshot wound. Yay! Sean Allen was arrested and sentenced to 20 years in prison. Hunter and Lola Green are no longer dating. Oh, <laughs> that's kind of sad. I mean, you know, I can understand them not. Wait, is that because I said I don't know? I wonder if I chose diff. Hold on. <laughs> okay, I'm just curious, like, if they'll stay together if I pick I Forgive You. You're the only guy who's ever taken a bullet for me. <laughs> it's true. That has to count for something. Hunter Smith was airlifted to a nearby hospital and survived his gunshot wound. Sean Allen was arrested and sentenced to 20 years in prison. And Hunter and Lola Green have since entered the witness relocation program together. Oh, Wait. <laughs> well, I mean, no, it's romantic that they're still together, but kind of sucks they gotta, you know, basically look over their shoulder the rest of their lives. But, yeah, okay. I just wanted to see if it would be different. And that shows how stupid Sean is for wanting revenge. You would have only had either, you know, half a decade or an entire decade. Now, you, now you've for sure got two decades when he should have just tried to do his time, get out on good behavior, and then just go live his life. But no, he wanted to be stupid, so he gets what he deserves. But I hope you guys enjoyed that one. That one was more so wholesome than the other ones I've been reading. All the other ones just end so in such a bad way, but... Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time for another Cliffhanger Tech Story.